Hey fellow explorers, it's again me, Mario. Today we're going to talk about grappling hook. Where to start? Grappling hook might well be the first, the worst item in the whole game. Like, at, on the top of my mind, there's nothing that's worse than grappling hook. I think it's just a really bad card. I don't know why it was balanced that way, but it's just really, really bad. I think there are some corner cases scenarios in which it can be barely fine, but I don't think there's any scenario in which you actively want this card in your deck. Like, really, no case. No corner case in which Grappling Hook is going to be good. It's going to be decent sometimes. You might buy it late in the game just to get points, but that's the only reason you actively might want to get a Grappling Hook in your deck. Let's see why, because, I mean, on the surface, it doesn't look that bad. It's a card that exiles other cards, and, you know, you already know if you followed my videos and my articles that I don't really think... They are worth it most of the times, but at least the other items have the decency to provide you with something. Like uh, the torch gives you uh, a tablet, the axe gives you a compass on top of the exiling. This card does nothing. Why? It seems like, it looks like it's going to draw you a card, so that should be uh, decent. But if it lets you draw a card and exile a card, then it would be a very good card, actually. Be well, not very good, but for sure better than both Axe and Torch. Instead, it asks you to discard a card before drawing a card. Um, I mean, it's it was hard for me at first to point out why this card is so bad, but take a look at it and think about it. So, drawing and discarding might net you a one value, but it's a might. If you draw a, an item that it's worth a value of two, then yeah, you can net a value. Otherwise, it may be like, you, you're, not, you're not going to gain anything. So the only thing that the card does is exiling a fear card. So it's barely possible if you exile a fear card. It's decent if you draw into like a value two item while discarding a fear card. But if you're already, if you're doing anything else than discarding a fear card, grappling hook is really bad. So you're going to be down a card at the end of the day because you draw one, you discard one, but you're using grappling hook, which is another card in your hand. So you're going to get four cards in your hand at the end of the deal, which is very bad. I mean, you want to draw more cards, not you know, shrink your hand for no reason. And the only upside that you're going to get is exiling a fear card. So again, the only case in which this card is decent is when you're going to draw into a good value item. So it might be that getting this card on the first round and then buying an item on the second round and then drawing into it thanks to grappling hook might work. But here's the trick. It's not true. If you didn't buy Grappling Hook in the first place, you would have drawn another card, you know? There would have been another card in your hand anyway, because it cycles itself. It doesn't draw you um, a new card. It just draws you a card you would have drawn if you didn't have Grappling Hook in your deck first. So that's something you should always keep in mind. Every time that you see a self-cycling card, you should look at the value you can get out of it, not at the fact that the card draw is valuable. Because if the card draw itself was valuable, then it was just better not having grappling hook in your hand, because you would have drawn into the new card anyway, into the other card, the value card anyway. So yeah, there's really no way grappling hook is going to be more than decent, and it's only decent if you're discarding and exciting a fear card. If you're discarding a value one card, you're going to be down in overall value. It would have been better if you didn't purchase Grappling Hook at first and you drawn into the other card. So this card is just good. No, not good. It's never good. It's just decent if you can exile a fear card with it. Otherwise, it's always bad. And, I mean, where's the reason? You, you shouldn't just get this card. Like, don't get it ever other than on the last round on 
on the second to last round to get points if you're sure you're not going to draw into it. Otherwise, really, I mean, maybe you, you have a lot of fear cards and you need ways to excite them, but the game is going to provide you with way better ways to discard cards. I mean, get an axe, get a torch, don't get a grappling hook. They're going to be better all the time. So, yeah, what I'm saying is don't get grappling hook. It's, it's going to make your deck actively worse most of the times. So, no, avoid it and you're going to be happy with it.